The Thirteenth Letter of Brother Lawrence I am in pain to see you suffer so long. What gives me some ease and sweetens the feeling I have of your griefs is that they are proofs of God's love towards you. See them in that view, and you will bear them more easily. As your case is, tis my opinion that you should leave off human remedies and resign yourself entirely to the providence of God. Perhaps he stays only for that resignation and a perfect trust in him to cure you. Since, notwithstanding all your cares, physic has hitherto proved unsuccessful and your malady still increases, it will not be tempting God to abandon yourself in his hands and expect all from him. I told you in my last letter that he sometimes permits bodily diseases to cure the distempers of the soul. Have courage then. Make a virtue of necessity. Ask of God, not deliverance from your pains, but strength to bear resolutely for the love of him all that he should please and as long it as he shall please. Such prayers, indeed, are a little hard to nature. <coughs> Such prayers, indeed, are a little hard to nature, but most acceptable to God, and sweet to those that love Him. Love sweetens pains, and when one loves God, one suffers for His sake with joy and courage. Do you so, I beseech you. Comfort yourself with him, who is the only physician of all our maladies. He is the father of the afflicted, always ready to help us. He loves us infinitely more than we imagine. Love him, then, and seek not consolation elsewhere. I hope you will soon receive it. Adieu. I will help you with my prayers, poor as they are, and shall be always yours and our Lord.